All right. Hello. So, I'm gonna do a little update today. Don't drink out the toilet. Okay, so, um, I got my mini implants today. It's been six months, finally got, I got my new dentures, and then now I got my minis. And what did I just tell you? And, well, let me show it to you. So, here's the garden. They're lined up pretty good, I, get, I think, you know, it looks good to me. The top is where it gets a little, mm, mm, that looks kind of, I don't know. So, here's the top, okay. So, look, all right, you know, they don't look as lined up. Also, the top of my mouth looks scary to me, <laughs> you know, like, hills have eyes. If you ever seen that movie, it's scary. Uh, so, this one's hooking out kind of a lot. And I assume that they're going to be lining them up with different ones because I mean they just kind of screwed it in just to heal up and reveal the hole so I think these are just temporary maybe I'm guessing all this I've never been through this so I'm just saying I was making this video to ask you guys that are familiar with this kind of procedure did they look kind of weird at first like the first two weeks because I got I got to heal for two weeks and I mean I got stitches so I assumed they just put the new minis in, gonna let them heal up, do all that, and then it's like, okay, let's get the right screw in now that you're healed up a little better, and now that it's easy enough to just unscrew and screw back in, I think. Like I said, I'm just assuming all this. Um, but this is in. Four on the top, four on the bottom. They're minis. Uh, just like I've been telling y'all I was gonna get, so this is part of my next level of journey which is now I have to heal up again um, with my denture my new one remember how I said they had to make a new one it's because they weren't thick enough and I see why now they said that because they were really really thin they were like paper thin and I see now that they needed them big for these holes that they've drilled in so they have made deep pockets. Like my denture used to be as thin as that where you could see through it like that. And they said that's way too thin. So they had to do this and make that. I have not put these in since I left the dentist. Cause I left the dentist and I was like, I don't want to have these in my mouth right now. My mouth is numb. My mouth hurts and is numb. And I don't want anything in my mouth but a gauze. So uh, I'm scared. Mm. Yeah. Ooh, hey. What's up, guys? Why we here? Yeah, you know, they hurt like a motherfucker. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna wait a little bit. I'm still not sure. I mean, I might have to go in and get that bottom one adjusted a little bit because, oh my God. Also, my mouth is super tender right here from the shots that they were giving me. Like, oh, I can't afford to have my denture rubbing up against that right now. So that was a fail. Um, I just need to give my mouth a second. Cause like while they were putting my teeth in and they were like, does that feel like it's on the bar? Does this feel like it? And it's like, I can't feel anything from the top of my eyebrows down. Like, I don't know what I'm feeling in my mouth right now. Is it on the bar? I have no idea. It could be on the bar. It could be off the bar. It could be anything right now. All I feel is a piece of plastic in my mouth jiggling around. Oh, man. What an experience. So, anyway, I just thought I'd make a little update. This is where we're at got the minis in and now I'm kind of confused just kind of waiting healing up a little bit before I put those big old things back in my mouth because my mouth really really hurts right now. um so any advice that y'all have do you think that they look effed up do you think that they're they're manageable do they sometimes often look a little goofy 
Like I got a big old bug tooth. Got a big old gold nugget right there. Well, if it goes bad, I could just pull that gold nugget out, sell it, buy some freaking plastic keys or something. But anyway, thank y'all for listening. Thank y'all for being there, and thanks for being so supportive, everybody. Y'all that that took the time in my last video when I was really upset about the new set of dentures that really analyzed them and gave me some input about what you thought about them and the differences between both of them. It really does mean a lot to me that uh, the com the whole denture community has been really sweet and all of y'all are really sweet people and I feel like I try to be as sweet as I can too to everyone else. So I think that I also I'm happy to be part of y'all's community too and to help everyone else out because we're all just kind of like what in the world's going on and it's easy to feel vulnerable and it's easy to feel upset and a lot of different emotions because it's a lot of pain a lot of happiness a lot of it's all the whole spectrum of emotions really so I appreciate all of y'all I can't wait to update y'all with these new clip ins see if if I get a little better, if it looks a little better, and I can't wait to get the smile that I want. So far, still kind of nervous, but I'm just gonna let it play through. And then we'll, we'll get to those roads when we get there. But as far as the road right now, this is it. Thank y'all for watching, I appreciate y'all.